Hey guys, it's Greg here from TSG. For those of you who aren't aware and didn't pay attention to the credits last week, we're taking a week off to gear up for the second half of Lost and Cold, The Murder of John Daughtry, but we weren't going to leave you guys empty-handed. Over the course of recording this project, we have had plenty of fuck-ups and weird things that have happened while recording, so we figured, why not share some of those with you? So, we hope that you guys enjoy this very funny, cool, laid-back version of Lost and Cold. I like to call it episode 5.5, and that is the episode 1 through 5 bloopers. There's lots of great stuff, and don't worry, we won't be spoiling anything that hasn't been revealed yet. There'll be bloopers for the second half of the series that'll be coming after the series is over. But hope you uh, enjoy this as we take our week off to gear up for episode six. Until then, hope you guys enjoy the bloopers. But, uh, go ahead and uh, if I set this right there, go ahead and say something. Check, check. <laughs> what? I don't know. I'm just. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you wanted me to check you, so I was checking the mic. Greg, you can fuck off too. <laughs> Is that your mic tech? Is test? Is that your? Oh mic? shit! Test, test, one, two, one, two. Testing, testing, one, two. You know, just just bullshit something into the microphone to test for sound and quality. I honestly don't remember reading that hentai. <laughs> none of us. Do bullshit. None of us remember ever reading that hentai. <laughs> so this, yes, this takes place five years later. May you're going to be reading for Adrian, even though you're not on the voice of Adrian. I'm sorry to tell you. Um. <laughs> If you were, though, I'd name, name Adriana instead of Adrian. Adrian, Adrian. I don't know what to say. My name's Adriana. I'm investigating this murder down in California. I'm just here to interview you. <laughs> I hear you speak the words good. Can you tell me the words? I don't know. Did you know Target's really gay? I'm fucking mad. So, like, you go to Target and you see some lovers well. I hope the microphone picked that up. So that was I'm great. Like, Target's fucking gay. Do you know that? It's like, Jesus Christ, that is incredible. That is funny. Sorry. No, don't be sorry. Like, like for the most Perfect. part, it hasn't even been picking up the background noise at all. And just, I'm like, I hope it just picked that up. I really just hope. that. Just that. They loved each other more than anything in the world. I don't know. Or, wow. The opposite of what I said. <laughs> just take it from that line. You're good to go. Can, can I read this as a cat? Is I that a thing? <laughs> can I just add Y's in here? <laughs> we weren't we weren't a well known gallery at the t- at the time. Yeah. Stop thinking about daddy. Let's think about art and ways. I never stop thinking about daddy. Okay, well, daddy is the art. Daddy is life. Should rename my bank account to Daddy's Funds. <laughs> <laughs> I can do that. Oh, oh fuck! Holy shit! I can nickname. That's going in the bloopers. <laughs> <laughs> so there was this one time where I was supposed to record something really important, because like Ben's on his way, and I get embarrassed when Ben's here and I can't record as well. But then Greg walked over there, and so now he's over there, and I'm over here, and I'm recording over here, but he's over there. <laughs> you see the problem? So Greg's over there talking about 91 days with one of the people staying in my hotel room. And that's just what's happening right now. Oh, fuck, I missed a call from Ben. <laughs> He's probably here being like, what the fuck, Greg? God damn it. Uh, I missed a call too. <laughs> God, no. Fuck, man. Holy shit. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> He's on his way back now. He'll be here in less than 10 minutes. <laughs> okay, cool. Let's record this in less than 10 minutes. Let's get it done. <laughs> let's get it done. Yeah, done. Oh. All right. So, I was the creator assistant for Daddy's Dildo Collection. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I can't. I can't. That is what I've been thinking about this entire time. Daddy's Dildo Collection. Daddy's Dildo Collection. <laughs> Emporium. Emporium. <laughs> And arts. <laughs> and arts. <laughs> no, the dildo is the art. <laughs> the dildo is the art. Okay, cool. Four, f- yeah, four foot that. dildo. Possibly they thought if we hold a get of him, great. If not, oh well. Rather than we need to find this person immediately. Now, who is Nation 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 Athford? <laughs> and his name is William Sturgis. And I want to punch him in the fucking face. <laughs> So, for today's episode, instead of diving into William's background to help with with each scene and, you know, 
messing up my lines back and forth. <laughs> yes, 911, my boyfriend is missing. Uh, he, he was, I, I can't find him. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Damn it. Wasting your time. Waste my time, 2016. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. Um, oh, good cop, bad cop. That's naughty. <laughs> oh my God, okay. <laughs> Alright, I'll go ahead and bring up the in those I'll go ahead and bring up the, the script for us right Good now. Good cop, sexually depraved cop. Mm, yeah, That's, basically. That sounds like a smut I read once. Ooh! <laughs> it sounds like a smut I read once. <laughs> it would be a smut you read once. <laughs> <laughs> Most likely. So, like, feel free to shoot me down here, but I'm like, can I, I, I want to take some creative liberties here, and what if, what if Nathan was a necrophiliac, and he just... <laughs> <laughs> While you're gone, Sam was asking if you could take some liberties and ask you this. Yeah, no, like think of, you gotta gotta listen here. <laughs> think about it. <laughs> like, what if what if Nathan was a necrophiliac and he uh, just he asks right. if he can have some time with the body? Okay. No. Just say just dead for his condolences, right? Yeah, come on. Yeah. Just but like very open about it because uh, he doesn't he doesn't seem like a dishonest person. So he's like, you know, I just I miss him so much. Can I? Can I have some time with the body? I'm sorry, what? What? I haven't... I haven't gotten off in about a week now. <laughs> so, so hold on, Nathan. Let me, let me get this straight for a He's a necrophiliac, Anthony! I've tried, I've tried masturbating to the thoughts of it, but it doesn't, it, doesn't, it doesn't work. You want to fuck the body. I want to fuck the body. He wants to fuck the body. Can we not use such crude... Like this is my boyfriend we're talking about. I want to make love <laughs> to the body. <laughs> Have we swapped it for evidence yet? Is it clear that at least to the family? Can, like can I, can I, make love to the, I want to make love to the body. <laughs> I'll see what I can do. Thank you. <laughs> and then I, mean, they I miss off. him. You understand, I'm sure. What's no. the boyfriend's name again? <laughs> All right, Johnny. <laughs> oh, Johnny boy. <laughs> It is now. I'm gonna fill your dough tree. I don't know. What that <laughs> means. I'm not sure what that means. <laughs> like, it's not even how I pronounce your name, but okay, cool. <laughs> okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. So now that we've talked about fucking bodies, <laughs> let's talk about the fucking body. Oh, oh yeah. So, like, let's... <laughs> <laughs> did, 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 did they already know that I'm gonna fuck it? <laughs> oh, I actually go with that one. I was like, do they, do they think, do they know I'm gonna fuck it? Maybe they think I killed him so I can fuck him. Anyways, let's... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this fucker's guilty. All right, case closed. Let's throw him in the break, da, 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 da. We did it, boys. We did it. Yeah. yeah. Our mystery case. <laughs> That's it. We solved the murder. All right. New case, Anthony. <laughs> All right, cool. All right. All right. <laughs> no, I thought I was going to read for Adrian, too. Oh, God damn it. All right. <laughs> so, Leo, <laughs> you're in this event called the Prideful Nights. All right. All right, so we'll do another time. Right? I'm a pussy. <laughs> Leo likes to take it in the ass. I'm sure he does. <laughs> All right. <good. laughs> I just started laughing because, like, just imagining him in the bathroom, just like stopping this guy. Yeah. Like, I need to interview you right now. He's like, and then he showed up right next to me. I asked him to hold my dick while I was pissing, but he wouldn't do it. He's like, "What are you, some kind of gay?" No, I could Mario. do, I could do Toad from Mario. No. Hey, no. listen. No, no, we don't need Toad. We don't need Toad in Lost in Gold. Are you sure? Exactly what you mean. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, so Mr. Sturgis. God damn it. Ha <laughs> 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 Jesus Christ. It's a me, a Mr. Sturgis. <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! I killed your friend. Woohoo! <laughs> That's amazing. Oh, Mr. Sturgis. <laughs> Oh. So it was that kind of interview. Adrian. Oh. Please don't die. Jesus Christ. Oh. Hey, kid, you want some candy? <laughs> it must not be all that exciting to hear a grown man complain about his ex. His gay l- ex. His gay l- l- ex. Lex. <laughs> Lex is a good yeah. show. <laughs> that was awesome. Holy shit, I think we broke May. <laughs> gay Lex. I was, all, I was trying to stay in character all angry and you broke it, Greg. I mean, Brad. Oh, man. My answer. When I answer Nathan's. <laughs> oh, God, God damn it. <laughs> 
You said overselling. That was good. That was good. I was like, oh my god, there you go. It's just, just, we didn't, I didn't expect it. That was good. (laughs) That was good. Crystal, if you need to leave at this point, that's totally fine. Do you know what it's like to realize you loved a monster? That poor boy. Who? I'm so sorry. You're just like, who? I want you. Okay, like, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna direct you. I want you to like, like, who? Okay. Like you're baffled. Okay. <laughs> Go back a little bit. Brad, take it from that poor boy. That poor boy. Who? <laughs> Crap. You guys are getting shit. Sorry. Was that? Start it over, because that's... Yeah, I, want, I want you to be, like, yeah, you're like, caught off guard, like, you're caught off guard of, like, here, for the crinkling to be all, like, you'd be all... That? That was John? Because when you said that, it would be, like, that. 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 like a robot. That. That, that was John. Yes, uh, <laughs> I heard about a murder, and I didn't know it was him. So. A long Beep. sigh. Okay, so basically, how yeah, we got to... Uh, I'll take it from my line. I'll give you your lead up again. If there are no more questions. How did you know he was strangled? Oh god, I was simply... There's a train going by. <laughs> woo woo! How did you know he was strangled? Woo! Uh, I want to go, go back. I want to take, take his...